and welcome to the Aragon Analytics channel. For today's video, what I'd like to do is explain what the AK Caveman Zeotech is, how to do it, and how to use it. As a special treat, everyone's favorite rifle, the Century Arms RAS-47 will be used as a visual aid. The AK Caveman Zeotech is a method for using the Kalashnikov rifle's iron sights in a manner that allows you to pick up and align your sights much more rapidly than in the traditional manner. Because this method is not as precise as the traditional method, I only recommend using it for close engagements between 0 to 10 yards. Traditionally, what you would do to hit a target with an AK rifle would be to align the front sight post in the rear sight notch. This works fine for medium to long range targets. But for extreme close distances, it can be difficult to align the front sight in that small and narrow rear sight notch quickly especially in low light or under stress. For the caveman's EATEC method, what you want to do is look at the front sight post together with the left and right ears on the front sight shroud and align them so that they sit directly on top of the rear sight. You'll know that the elevation of the front sight and shroud is correct if it is sitting on top of the rear sight without any of the front sight tower showing. The front sight and shroud should be centered from left to right on the rear sight as well. This is what it should look like. As you can see, the front sight shroud provides a sight picture very similar to that of the circle dot reticle in an EOTech. If you align everything correctly, point of aim will be close to the point of impact from 0 to 10 yards. You can rapidly hit torso sized targets out to 15 or possibly 20 yards and it is much easier to acquire this sight picture in low light or under stress. However, if a surgical shot is required, you should go back to using the traditional aiming method. An extra benefit of using this method is that in that 0 to 10 yard range, it completely eliminates the need to correct for sight offset. What that means is that you don't need to worry about the fact that the sights are about two and a half inches above the rifle's bore. Using this method sort of automatically corrects for that. It is also much more precise than simply using only the front sight as many people advocate. Okay, now that the whole caveman's EATEC thing is all explained in detail, thank you very much for coming by to learn about this method for using the AK rifle, and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next video. If you found this information useful and or entertaining, please remember to like and subscribe. Take care. Bye-bye.